full capacity here at Razorback Stadium is more than 70,000 fans. And while the U of A has sold out of all the seats, they're now selling standing room only tickets in the north end zone for the very first time. And while they are expecting a very large crowd, they say they're going to take COVID-19 precautions very seriously. It's an exciting time. People are excited to be back cheering on the Hogs in person. And then when you have a, a longtime rival like Texas coming in, it really uh, is a perfect uh, combination, and, and Razorback fans are excited to be here. Fans filled the stands Saturday at the Razorbacks' home opener against Rice, but the U of A says all of those empty seats will be full for this weekend's game against Texas. For the first time ever, standing room only tickets are being sold in the north end zone. This is the first time it has been made available for a public standing room only. And, and it's really an effort just to get in as many Razorback fans as want to be a part of this. We won't get every Razorback fan in, uh, but certainly we want to give everyone an opportunity to be a part of this truly special day. Masks are strongly encouraged in Razorback Stadium. And if you're indoors at the stadium in the restrooms or shops, you'll need to follow the university's mask mandate. Fans may think I'm sitting outside. I don't, I don't need a mask, but if you go into hog heaven, if you go into our hall of honor, if you go into restrooms, or if you're seating in clubs and, and suite areas, you're going to need that mask. So we encourage fans to bring alongside a mask, even if you're sitting outside. Uh, we strongly encourage you to wear it throughout the stadium. Fans say whether they'll be in the sold out stadium or not, they're glad fans can be there in person to cheer on the Hogs. I'll still get to watch the game and that's really the most important part of me. As long as I get to watch it, I don't really care whether I'm in the stadium or I'm right outside the stadium. It's very different now that we actually get to do like real game days and be able to like be with our friends for the games. Compared to last year, a lot of us really didn't watch much of the games just because like the environment wasn't the same. Especially like this week, there will be a lot of travel like into the area for this game. So I mean, it's concerning as a student because like we really like the in-person classes and like being able to be on campus for like our last semester. But yeah, it's it's a tough like toss up. Well, just like the home opener against Rice, the U of A will have the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine available for people who want their first or second doses. One of those clinics will be held in Hogtown before the game, and the other one will be in the north end zone during Saturday's game against Texas. Reporting live in Fayetteville, Emma Claybrook, 4029 News.